Good day, human Latios audience. This is Latios Azuril, and welcome back to Let's Play Pokemon Grass Jewel 2. So here we are in Moss Deep City. Last time we took on the newly reopened Duford Town Gym. This time we are going to do some uh, more probably difficult battles. Hello there. Ah, the Moss Deep Space Center. What a great place for a battle. So, do you accept my challenge? Sure. Then let's get right to it. Alright. So, we battled the leader who, uh, is of course uh, an in-game cameo of a certain uh, creator of the game. But there are a few more uh, cameos for him. So, we're gonna go take them on today. Alright, so once again... In the Azuril-verse, anyone who is someone has an Azuril. Alright, come on. Let's get a flinch. Let's get a flinch here. We are going to get the flinch there. I am not going to play with... I Honestly, if we can get another flinch here... If we can get another flinch here, that is the best case scenario. Because that means we're not going to take any damage in this thing before he heals up. Otherwise, we go for Sacred Fire. Okay. That is actually perfect, because now... We get a free Sacred Fire off. He's not going to heal. I'm actually surprised. I mean, it's going to be the KO, so... Alright. That was actually really easy. Alright. Chikorita. Hey, let's stay in. We're going to Sacred Fire... Alright, Mudkip. I think Blizzard can just thunder it. Alright, thunder. That should do some damage. All right, we're Oko'ing. Latias! You know what, let's bring in our uh, newly crunch-equipped Lucario. Of course it's the Inspire Blast. Can we somehow live it? Come on, it's not Stab. You know, it's coming from a Latias, but... Alright, thank you for not burning. Thank you so much for not burning. Alright. But that does not do damage. Okay. Although, that thing is not soul do. Alright, fortunately for us, that thing's not soul do. Alright, let's go for another crunch, even though that Fire Blast is in all likelihood going to take us out. Come on. We can take it. We are taking it. Don't burn. Didn't burn. Crunch, and that should be enough. Alright, we're taking this thing down. Alright. Nice. Next up is Sylveon. We outspeed it, we can do some damage. Alright. Come on. Do not do not be slow. Okay, good. We are outspeeding. We're gonna get a meteor mash off, but the problem is we're probably not gonna OCO it. Never mind, we're gonna crit. Plus one? No plus one. Alright. Well, Luke is gonna get destroyed by Latios if I stay in, so there's really no reason to stay in there. Alright, so for Latios, I have a couple options. Um. Oh, we have speed. If I can take a hit, then we win. If I can't take a hit, then 
Miss Ball. Okay, so you're going for the. You want to lower my special attack. And you did. Huh. Well, I think unpaid is still going to be enough. You know what? I'm just going to go for Pixie Kick just to be safe. Just to play it safe. There we go. That wasn't too bad. Congratulations, you win. And we got a lot of money. I wonder what space is like with Pokemon. Huh. Well, you know what? I think we should probably heal up our Pokemon, though. But that surprisingly didn't go too badly. Alright, so... Let's give some coffee back to Luke. And also the jumps, because jumps no longer really need that experience share, considering. Alright. So here we are back on Azura Island. Now, over here, this guy. Yep, he's here again. He's literally all over the place. Welcome, I feel that a victory is simply inevitable. So let's have a battle. Now let's get right to it. So yeah, there are there are several in-game cameos here. <laughs> of them. Alright. Do I risk not getting the flinch here? Once again, if we can get two flinches, we're in really good shape. Otherwise, then I would have been better off going for the Sacred Fire to at least live a hit. Oh, God. Welp! We're taking an epic justice to face, aren't we? Okay. This happened. This did officially just happen. Alright, Luke, I need you to outspeed this thing, because if this thing hits you with an epic justice, then then we're in trouble. Alright, Hydro Pump is I mean it's not stab. But as long as you don't as long as it's in special, so we can take that. We can take it. The big problem is epic justice. Alright, we're plus one now. And we still have our coffee. So, we're not in a bad position right now. Alright. Let's cross chop. Because a plus one, I think that should do enough damage. Alright. We're good. Victini. You know what? Plus one crunch. Plus one crunch. Is this enough? It is not enough. Alright. Well, Luke, it's been fun. It has definitely been fun. But alas, you have been defeated. Alright. Um... He is healing up. That is very, very not good for us. <laughs> Alright. I should have just thundered and hoped for the para.
You know what? That thing is rock slide. Never mind. We're done. Blizzard, I'm sorry, but you're not living that. There's literally no world where you live that. There is no parallel universe in existence where you could possibly live that rock slide. Oh boy. Okay, so Tails, I'm sorry, but I'm gonna have to say I can at this point. Kinda sucks, but that's kind of the way things are. Alright. Because Happy, if Luke could outspeed this thing, then Happy can outspeed it. If Happy outspeeds it, we can just unpay it, and it's going down at this point at half health. So, the thing is, Tails should be able to live a rock slide, which means we should be able to live two rock slides because of the coffee boost, which means we can heal up two Pokemon. Given the fact that it's a Victini using a flinch move, there's really no op no reason for us to uh, try attacking it because we're only gonna flinch anyway. So let's just heal everyone up. That's probably the safe play here. And Victini is gonna miss. <laughs> okay. Okay. The Victory Star Pokemon is actually gonna miss a move. Funny! Funny. Alright. So, Tails, you've officially done your job. Only you do not speed it. You know, Shadow Ball would have been nice around now. But you know, Tails, you get to go down knowing you did your job. And you set us up for, for victory here. Because now everyone else is perfectly healthy, and we get to get rid of that Victini with an unpaid eye. Alright. Alright, so Victini is down. Next up is Shaman. Well, my concern with this is if we don't outspeed. Or, you know what? We don't have speed. But if we can somehow not flinch, that would be very nice. Very unlikely, but... Oh, wow. Okay. That actually works out well, because now your rock spider can do a lot less damage. Although it's sun-boosted, so... <laughs> oh my goodness, that is actually perfect. I don't care about your leftovers, that's not enough. It's not enough. Burn damage gonna take you down. That's what I'm talking about. Alright. And we're gonna get a coffee boost, which I believe will bring us back to full health. There we go. Kinchino. Let's go into Luke. Really not a whole lot it can do to us, considering the fact that, um, we can't flinch. Alright. Cross chop, and I'm pretty sure you're not taking this. We're good. Alright, and Emolga. Well, uh, I have trouble imagining Emolga one-shotting Don Fan.
I mean, it's possible, but... I just have trouble imagining it. Although, that was... Never mind! You're getting the crit! That... Crits do happen. And you just got one of them. And that actually hurts me deep down. Because I guarantee that crit mattered. Alright. Alright, Aeroblast, we can take it though. If it, you're more. Yeah, it's not a. Are you seriously gonna miss? That Emolga is doing so much better than it should be doing. Alright, Thunder's gonna KO. Isn't it? We lived! And we're powered! Oh my god. But we're landing it! Oh my goodness. This battle is like a, an emotional roller coaster. <laughs> and we're gonna one shot it with Blizzard, and that is. That is GG. Congratulations, you win. Alright, and we're getting a bunch of money. No matter how the battle ends, at the end of the day, all Pokemon are our friends. Fair enough. Okay, well, we gotta heal up. We are taking too much uh, damage from these battles, I gotta say. Alright. Now you might have noticed along Route 120, there is a uh, there is a certain place that is uh, well. I guess we're battling these two. We're well, battling this guy, considering because we didn't battle him before. Lionel with a Manectric. You know what? That's fine. This will be a nice, easy battle. Let's call it a warm-up. Even though it's barely, barely counts as a battle. Not even a challenge. Now, of course, up here we have the, uh, we have the Mudkip Marsh. Um... But if you notice, there's actually a little, uh, cottage right here. Once we, uh, you know, get past the surskit. So, right here, this is the Azuril Cottage. Welcome to the Azuril Cottage. How would you like to battle? Now let's get right to it. Alright, let's do this. Alright. Leading off with Mudkip. Well, that's a bit different. This is definitely a little different, I gotta say. Alright, come on. Flinch. Alright, there's the flinch. It's gonna heal up, but that's okay. We can unpay it here. Unpay it will be enough to Oko, though. Based on the damage Air Slash was doing. Alright, 
There we go. Next up is Chikorita. I guess uh, Air Slash is probably the safe place to be super effective and all. I mean, I could Sacred Fire, but this is at least Stab. Alright. Next up is Shaman. Well... At least it's that we can't flinch. Alright, it's gonna air slash, but that is fine with me. Are you seriously doing that much damage? Alright, you know what, that's okay, because that means we are gonna pop the coffee. We're gonna crit there. We're not gonna plus. We're not gonna get the plus one. So honestly, I kind of would have rather get the plus one, got the plus one than the uh, than the crit there. I would have much preferred a plus one than a crit. But that's okay. Give another chance. Okay, come on. Look, I know you can do it. Plus one. There's the plus one. Alright, now I think we're in good shape. Because as long as that air slash doesn't crit, even that crit, I think we can live. Oh wow, that is literally one HP away from it being half health. So that wouldn't <laughs> that wouldn't activate the coffee or there's a crit, now that I think I don't think a crit mattered. Brings the plus two. We're in not bad shape, actually. Next up is Lapras. Okay. It's cross Chop. Plus two Cross Chop. I think we're in good shape here. Stab, super effective, plus two from Luke. We're good. Alright, next up is Azuril. Well, the problem with the Zuru is we're gonna have to outspeed it, which I don't think we're gonna do. We are! Okay! Never mind. I'm sorry, Azuru, but this is really gonna hurt. We're not getting the plus three, but you know what? I don't think we need the plus three, to be honest. Alright. Next up is Latios. That's a problem because. We are at plus two, but we're not outspeeding this thing. That is gonna KO. That is gonna KO us. We would have lived if we were at full health, though, sadly. Alright. I'm gonna pixie kick, maybe we can get the flinch. If we can get the flinch, we'll be in good shape. If we can't get the flinch, then, you know, we can heal up and try again. Flinch. There's the flinch. Alright. I'm gonna unpay day now. It'll probably do less damage, because Latios does have more special bulk than physical bulk. On the other hand, it does, do a, it does have a high, much higher base power, so you never know. I don't know, Latios is kind of insanely powerful. And yeah, that really didn't do that much damage compared to Pixie Kick. Pixie Kick is physical. Alright, I guess this thing does probably a soul do. So that also probably contributes to that. But you know what, Pixie Kick is going to take this thing down nonetheless. And with that, we have defeated Pokemon Master Eric. You win. Ah. No matter how the battle ends, at the end of the day, all Pokemon are our friends. Alright. I think Luke's the only one who really took any damage, but boy did he take damage.
There's no way someone like you could beat me in a battle. Let's go. But let's get right to it. Alright, let's do this. Alright. Lady Samantha with the Pachi Risu. Alright, you know what? Please don't static me. Please don't static. Alright. No static. Let's unpayday now. There we go. Next up is Pichu. I mean, I'm concerned about taking a water move from this thing, because we don't have the sun up. Hmm. Alright, we're gonna outspeed anyway. Alright, Peach is going down. Next up is Charmander. We're outspeeding that. I think we're in good shape. Alright, next up is Cyndaquil. Yeah, I think we're, we're probably okay in this match. Because <laughs> this... Yeah, this team has a really bad weakness to ground. Alright, next up is Teddy Ursa. Alright, that's a little bit more concerning. Alright. Let's go to Luke. Alright, there's a mint teddy bear. Let's cross chop. And Blissey. Alright, well, this is a little concerning. This is a little bit concerning. Just a little bit, but still concerning nonetheless. Alright, getting the attack boost. Not that it even matters. You got a Blissey in your running Bane attack. That's just messed up. <laughs> Alright. Alright, Fan... If that thing outspeeds us with Bane attack, then I'm just gonna call hack. I'm just gonna... <laughs> Alright, we're landing the EQ. That should do some damage. Ugh. <sighs> I know she's going to heal at this point. You see, and now I feel bad for calling this team easy to beat, considering... <laughs> it's funny how the first four... Actually, I guess the first five went down pretty easily. But that last one... Oh my goodness. This Blissey is just messed up. Alright. So, it burned... So at least there's that chip damage. Unfortunately, I can't knock off the leftovers recovery, so that'll be a problem. Not one that I can't deal with. 
Okay, I need this thing to just keep flinching. Alright, I think the attack plan here is... Let this thing take some more burn damage. So I'm gonna actually sack Happy at this point. In order to secure the win. This is to secure the win. Because for some reason, this thing loves using Fan Attack. And apparently, it doesn't want to use anything but Fan Attack. Part of me wants to believe that that thing somehow, although it has leftovers, it's somehow choiced into Fan Attack. Alright, but Meteor Mash will KO at this point, so we're fine. But, yeah, that's... that's a bit of an ugly strategy. <laughs> when in doubt, spam fan attack. Alright. Is it Sunday yet? <laughs> you know, you can act, you can cook, and you can protect others, but regardless of the situation, you always have your family and friends. Alright. So yeah, that is the uh, Azuril Cottage. Um, not a whole lot there, but you know, it's something. So we shall heal up. Definitely used some coffee in that map in that battle. Oh no, we definitely didn't. Wow. Oh yeah, of course we didn't because we didn't take any damage other than from the Blissey, but that thing was just spamming uh main attack. Well, I guess that happens. What are you gonna do? Alright, hi there, Chansey. And of course, here is one more interesting area. Sacred Field. So here, there's... Just a random Kyoko and a Groudon sitting around, but the interesting thing is... In the wild... This is where you can catch the legendary birds. So, just in case you know you didn't choose uh, these, um, you didn't choose like Zapdos, Articuno, or Moltres in particular as your starter, you can still catch them in the post game. All right, so you're in the red zone. Let's catch you. Let's go. Come on, stay in the ball. Make my life easy. Thank you! Alright. So we got the flame Pokemon, Multiface. So I'm gonna call you. Flames. Alright. Which means there is, I guess, technically one final legendary that we, uh, don't yet have. So I guess Latias wasn't really our last legendary. Although these aren't static, so you can essentially catch as many of uh, the Articuno, Zapdos, and Moltres as you want. So I guess when you really get down to it, this is like the, uh, the Let's Go before Let's Go. With like the infinite, uh, with infinite uh, legendary birds. Although apparently Moltres seems to be all that is appearing for us.
That's kind of sad. One of these days we should be able to find a Zapdos. Here we go. Now, of course, Articuno is also here. But in the case of Articuno, we don't exactly, uh, well, need one. All right, flinch. Thank you. Do not crit. Do not crit. Thank you, flinch. Thank you. Let's do this. Stay in the ball. Thank you. All right, so with that, we have officially captured all the legendaries in this game. All right. Call you... Zapster. Of course, there's also Rutini here. Level 45, so it's not too far from being Dragonite. There's a Latios and a Latios. And, of course, there's a Zuril. When there's a, where there's a Zuril, you can bet there's also someone else. Hello. Welcome to Sacred Field. Would you like to battle? Sure. Then let's get right to it. Alright, let's do it. This is the, uh, this is the final one. <laughs> there are, I believe, five of them? I think five of them. Alright. So this time he is once again leading off Mudkip. Alright. Well, I have learned from, uh, from the past. We can just straight up on Payday here. There's really no reason to... Actually, I probably should have just let him use up his full restores on this thing. But that's okay. That is fine. Alright, next up is Chikorita. Air Slash. We can do this. Alright. So we're good with that. Next up is Charmander. What a fan. That'll do some damage. Alright. Azuril. This thing we got outspeed or we're gonna have some problems. <laughs> Alright. Pixie Kick. Um, that's fine. Actually, I don't know. Stab and physical. That's gonna hurt. We're gonna live, though. So, that actually works out pretty well for us. And plus one. And we get the coffee. You know what, that works out pretty well, because that means we're at plus one against the Blissey. Nothing better than a Fain attack. <laughs> Alright. Plus one, is that enough? I know plus two would be enough. I don't know if plus one is going to be enough to KO this thing. Uh, I don't think so. No, it's not. Unpayday. Alright, that's fine. We resist it. It's fine. You know what? Let him heal. Let him keep healing. I, I'm fine with that. In fact, maybe we can even get this to plus three. This is for the plus two. 
So once again, we're not going to take this thing out unless we crit, but honestly, I'd rather get the plus two than the crit. We're getting neither. So of course it's going to heal again. But that's fine. It's not the end of the world. Definitely not the end of the world. Let him use up all of his full restores on this thing. Because the last thing I want to see is him to uh, use him up on the uh, little audios. Alright, there's the plus two. Come on, give me a plus three. He's healing up, you know what? That I don't get why you're facing a plus two Lucario with Meteor Mash for your Blissey out. I don't get why you'd full restore at this point, but you know what? Hey, I'm glad you did. Makes my life easier. Although when you get right down to it, I guess I'm only battling myself. Alright, and there's the Oko, and plus three. All we gotta do is live one hit from that Latios, and it's done. We just gotta live one hit. We just gotta live one hit. We just gotta take one missed ball. Come on. Come on, somehow live. Nope! Not even. Not even. Alright. Pixie Kick. Pixie Kick, Flinch, and then Pixie Kick again. Since he's a ball is full restores on Blizzy, I think we should be okay with the Latios. <laughs> There's the Flinch! Alright, I guess he did have another full restore after all. But you know what? That's fine. As long as we don't miss the pixie kick, we're in good shape. And if we crit here, then it just ends right here. Alright, we're not gonna crit. There's another pixie kick, and that is GG. We are victorious. Congratulations, you win. So, yeah, we got a lot of money. No matter how the battle ends, at the end of the day, all Pokemon are our friends. Alright. So, please, you must listen to this. It's about my darling mine, and whenever anyone picks it up, it leaps straight into my arms. Oh, could there be anything more blissful? Oh, it feels so heavenly. I'm so glad I could share some happiness with you. Fair enough. So with that, we have uh, defeated basically all five of the uh, of the cam of my uh, cameos in the game. Of course, the first one uh, we did last time that was the do for Jim. All right. That said, let's go heal up somewhere. So, yeah, there's really not too, too much more for us to do. There's a few more things for us to go uh, explore, but we've uh, done a lot of stuff. That said, there's a couple more things for us to explore, I suppose. So... Next time, we're going to uh, see what else we have to do. So thank you for watching. As always, like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys next time when we continue with uh, investigating what there is to do in the post-game of Pokemon Grass Jewel 2. Goodbye!